WBME presents Racine and Me, a weekly look at the events and issues for Racine. Now here is your host from CBS 58 News, Sherry Dunn. Good morning, everyone. I am Sherry Dunn. Welcome to another edition of Racine and Me, our weekly look at events and issues in Racine and Racine County. And joining me this morning are some very special guests. This is their second time on our show. Do not adjust your sets. These young ladies have been here before. We are joined this morning by Samantha Knoll and Madison Richards, and also Lauren Nixon, who's off set right now, but he'll be joining us after the break. And uh, there's a reason you ladies are back, and that's because you're winners again. Tell us what you've won again. Um, we won the C-SPAN student camp competition, and that was grand prize, and we won the Hang Tough competition, and we got first place. Now that is exciting. When you guys were here last time, Madison, you were saying you guys were going to submit this. Had you done it already when you were here last time, or were you still working on it? Oh uh, yeah, it was done and submitted the last time. What happened was we submitted a script much earlier in the year, and we had um, just made it, I believe, when we were here the last time, so yeah. That is really something. So you guys, when, when we talk about them doing this, they actually did this. You actually shot it and edited it and even in this case acted in it, right? Yeah. So how did you come up with this uh, Hang Tough? Well, first of all, let's talk about Hang Tough. Hang Tough is sponsored by Time Warner Cable mm -hmm. and it is for young people to put together videos to help other young people understand how to avoid peer pressure for things like drugs, alcohol, and bullying. Is that right? Mm -hmm. Yep. And so the goal is to kind of put together this video so that other kids can see, well, what, what is wrong with these things, right? Mm -hmm. So how did you guys decide to pick uh, what topic did you take in the Hang Tough video? Did you take one? Did you take them all? And, and how did you make that decision? Well, we addressed um, smoking, alcohol, and bullying. And we kind of took off from the same idea we used in a previous competition, except applied it to the no um, standing strong against bad influences. Mm -hmm. and, and you guys acted in it, too. Yeah. Yeah. And so and did you, how did you decide you were going to write it and act in it? Um, the rules of the competition is you act in your own video, so we made our script, we sent it in, and then you have someone film it for you, and then like your producer from Time Warner Cable, they edit it for you, just tell them, we kind of told them what we, how we wanted it done, and then he made it more professional for us. But you guys didn't really need that help because you've done the editing and the shooting yourself, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That is really something. Well, you know what, let's uh, take a look at your win. I think we have some videotape of when you guys found out you won. The Hang Tough video Finley Middle Charter School, Racine. And that is at the event. I think oh, we're going to get a tight shot. Fun. There you girls are. Oh, look at that excitement. So, who will be the lucky bachelorette? My choice is none of them. I know who they really are. That was exciting. Now, what was that moment like when they called your names? It was so shocking, like, because I, there were a few really good ones, and we weren't sure how well we would do, and so I, we were just really happy to hear our names. And what did you win? Um, we won a trip to Disney World. It's three days and two nights, so they fly us out, and they pay for everything, so we're really excited. My goodness! This is incredible. And so, But one of the things that people out there need to know is these are not your first contests that you girls have entered. Mm -hmm. You have actually, in point of fact, won every contest you've entered since you started entering contests, video contests. Is that right? Yeah. Yep. We entered last year's C-SPAN competition. We won first place in our division, and that was the middle school division. Then we entered the Westinghouse competition. We won first place, and then C-SPAN grand prize this year, and then Hang Tough competition. And you're only in the eighth grade? Mm -hmm. Yep. So you got a lot of time left. You know, well, let's take a look. We're going to take a look now at uh, the winning Hang Tough video. So let's take a look at the winning video. It is now time to select the lucky bachelorette. Let's hear one final word from each of the contestants. I'll be a smoking hot date. They'll set you on fire. I'll make sure no one gets in our way of having a good time. With a little help from me, you'll be the life of the party. So, who will be the lucky bachelorette? My choice is none of them. I know who they really are. It is now time to select the lucky bachelorette. Let's hear one final word from each of the contestants. I'll be a smoking hot date. They'll set you on fire. I'll make sure no one gets in our way of having a good time. With a little help from me, you'll be the life of the party. So, who will be the lucky bachelorette? My choice is none of them. I know who they really are. 
simple kind of approach. And so it's based on the dating game theme, huh? Mm -hmm. Yep. Uh, no, you're old enough for the dating game. So where'd you hear about that? Um, actually, one of our, it was our eighth grade um, documentary member from last year. She thought of it for a Westinghouse competition. And I don't know where she thought of it from, but she was like researching of an idea. And then she decided we should go with that for Westinghouse. And we decided to take up from that idea because it works so well in another competition. And now each of you had to have a character. So what was it like acting? You had to be the bully. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> I don't know. I didn't want to do it at first, but it was really fun, like just to try and play the bully and everything. And why do you think that that video really connected to the judges there? Um, well, it's kind of humorous how we act our parts, and it shows all the different aspects of bullying, drinking, and cigarettes, and like kind of how peer pressure is, and it shows that how The Bachelor stays strong. And it actually kind of showed a boy making good choices about the women he might hang out <laughs> with, let's say. Yeah. And so some of these uh, women were not very good choices, right? Yeah, no. it faded or it faded out in the end and showed who we really were in that everything's not always as it seems. And that's an important lesson for kids and adults to remember in life, quite frankly. Mm -hmm. And so that's really innovative. And so how are you girls feeling about that win? Are you ready to just start on something new now? Um, uh, yeah, <laughs> we're ready to uh, start a new project. We're gonna do C-Spin again next year. So really there's like no competitions over the summer. So we're just gonna have fun, enjoy our trip to Disney World and just wow. wait till we get there. Now, when do you go to Disney World? When can you, well, when can you go? we're hoping, the dates didn't work out because we're all going to D.C. for our eighth grade, mm -hmm. um, the three of us at least, and so we are hoping to go in May. In May. So, okay. well, this month. This yeah. month. Okay, well, that is awesome. Well, when we come back, we're going to talk um, next with Lauren Nix, and she's going to join us, and we're going to talk a little bit about the C-SPAN competition that the ladies did and what motivates them and how kids who are out there today might get involved in something like them, this themselves. We'll be right back.